you can manifest whatever it is that you deserve in life and yes the universe will give everything to you but you need to give something back to the universe you need to ask yourself this question who is the middleman between you and that what you want in life it is the universe right so we have to follow the rules of the universe and we cannot fool the universe here we can fool people but we cannot fool the universe because the universe has an intelligence that belongs to the divine you can be in complete bliss and peace every single moment of your life and along with that manifest whatever it is that you deserve the universe will give all of it to you but in return the universe asks something from you to give up and what is it that you need to give up in order to please the universe you need to give up your attachment for things and for people only when you give up your attachment for things and people you can be able to have love within you love for yourself love for people and love for whatever it is that you want in life if you do not have love within you and if you only have attachment for things attachment for people then even if you do get it or if you already have it this is going to create a lot of negativity in your life and if you have no attachment within you and if you have only love in your heart for it whatever it is that you have or if you want this is going to create a lot of positivity most people always misunderstand love for attachment these are two completely different phenomenons attachment is one of the biggest obstacles in your way to spirituality and manifestation belongs to the world of spirituality if there is attachment within you for things for people then to enter the world of spirituality is very difficult for you the universe wants you to give up your attachment for things and for people and only acting is not going to work here you can act in front of people you can act when you go for a job interview in front of your interviewer you can pretend to be something that you are not but you cannot pretend in front of the universe you can lie to people but you cannot lie to yourself and you cannot lie to the universe if you lie to yourself then this puts you in more and more delusion and a delusional person cannot be a spiritual person and you cannot lie to the universe because the universe has an intelligence that belongs to the divine that belongs to the beyond you cannot pretend to have given up your attachment and you cannot pretend that you have understood what love is you have to have an experience you have to set out on a journey of giving up your attachments and only having love in your heart for whatever it is that you want or whatever it is that you have in life and understand that love is completely separate from attachment most of us think that attachment and love are the same things because we have been trained in such a manner to think so most of us feel how can we love this person without being attached but the truth is you cannot love this person as long as attachment is there in your heart for this person love is beautiful but only when there is no attachment in your heart attachment creates a very unloving space within you we need to understand that when there is attachment within you then there is a need to possess that person or that thing and when there is a need to possess that person or thing then this creates a lot of fear within you that you will lose this person or that thing so if there is fear within if there is any amount of fear in your heart it will be very difficult for you to love where there is fear love cannot exist especially if it is somebody that you are trying to attract then trying to possess that person because of your attachment is trying to reduce that one person to a commodity which is completely inhuman the moment you try to possess it becomes trying to exploit somebody if you are trying to possess someone because of attachment then love cannot exist over there because love is against trying to exploit somebody trying to possess somebody means trying to exploit someone 
and if you are trying to possess somebody then there is creating a bondage on that person and when you are creating a bondage on that person there will always be fear in your heart about losing that person because every human being wants freedom consciously or subconsciously a human being will always rebel against your need to possess that person these are just a few examples ultimately what the universe wants from you is to give up your need to get attached to things and people the universe wants you to give up your need to possess people and things the universe wants you to be free the universe wants you to open up like a flower the universe wants you to wake up spiritually the universe wants to give you everything that you deserve all it wants from you is to move a little bit out of your comfort zone and take a few steps in the path of spirituality so that you can reach your goals of manifestation the universe does not want to see you in misery or suffering the universe does not want to see you in sadness or depression the universe wants you to be in eternal peace and happiness all you have to do is trust the universe